Are you going to put the top down? Are you going to put the top down? Good show. Got to clear it out with these girls. Is this the uh, power top or manual? Power. Cool beans. A little bit. What's interesting here is that you guys see all the relays and whatnot, which really got it through. Got, got to empty the trunk in order to lower everything because unfortunately, so the uh, top does take up quite a bit of room. There's still a little bit of room left, but not when you Not much. Not much. Crap. Not when you have junk in your trunk. Oh, please. We don't have junk in our trunks. <laughs> Now check out the, uh, you'll see the hydraulics over there for lifting it. I'm surprised you didn't have it today driving in. I was going to, but I was running late, so I just figured. Yeah. Okay, very good. I'll let you then. This is a nice treat here. Release the uh, header. Make sure everything's clear. You don't have to start her up? I just put the key on. Oh, okay. I forget. I haven't had the car that long. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, uh, let's try the red here. There we go. Now, note the way how that goes up and takes a ton of with it, the very back. A boot, actually, in this case. Look at the heavy castings needed over there. Now check out how much it uh, takes up. Oh, that system's not working all the way then. No, it does. This is manual. Okay. <laughs> and you still have the cell noise to release it up there. I'm going to take a quick look at the hydraulics under here. See the pump just like the convertibles underneath the whole thing. Nice clean look. This is what, 60? Yeah. 59. 59, okay. Yeah, definitely the windows should go down. You get some really wild stuff. Beautiful convertible. How you doing? Good, how are you? Having a ball. I'm glad you're driving a car correctly with the top down. That's the only way to drive it. That's right. Hey, when you go cruising, you go cruising. That's right. Now, do you have to tie your beard up so it doesn't go over your eyes? No, I get him to hold it down. Oh, okay. That's cool. <laughs> there you go. There you go. I love it. Thank you. Have fun. Is that beautiful? This is my love. Look at the variation. Prowler. 
and of course the little uh, retro birds. Well, continue having a great year. Thank you. I'll try to. Fifty-six, baby. This is a beautiful combo with the trailer. 36 Ford um, rumble seat. Now, I want to share with you, look at the uh, Ed and Mayer heads, the twin carbs. Put on the alternator there, but that's all right. Just beautifully hot rodded. Nice interior. Couple extra gauges, but it's got the radio. Carlisle. See how quickly you could spot what this is. It's a 52, four cylinder overhead cam. Does this have the disc brakes? Does this have the disc brakes? I don't think so. Okay. Didn't have the, uh, I'm not sure if they were optional or not in 52 on this car. But they did pioneer it. That'll give you a hint what it is. Once we uh, pull off to the tail, you'll definitely know what it is. Crossmobile, not Crosley. Great. Oh, look at this Buick. Ah! Beautiful. All right, let's check out Bill's 57 Ford Skyliner. Ford Skyliner. Uh, this car, why I wanted to do an uh, interview with Bill is because this car has a very unusual option amongst other things it is an e-code now check that out that's the Thunderbird motor but even more so than that it's got icing on the cake two four barrels only 38 were ever made only 38 were ever made now this car came into your shop which is Showcase Restorations up in uh, Salem, New Hampshire. How to get that straight? Put in the plug with the hey. hey now, th this is always the show for everybody. Now, as mentioned before, you're going to see the screw jacks there. You notice the way how the uh, front of the roof folds in, the deck drops. Now, you're seeing the screws going on over there to latch. What's interesting, this whole thing was actually devised for Lincoln. 30, 30 years before it's time. Definitely. And again, there's no electronics. This is all trip switches and relays. You know how the uh, tip of the roof folds out? It's fascinating the way how they devise how this whole thing works. Now notice the tanu uh, drops. And down she goes. I'm going to zoom in there. You can see the way. And that's it. That is fantastic. I like Again, this is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com at the 2018 Dorman's Helps Car Show. Checking out the 59 T-Bird. For more cool events like this, make sure you check NortheastWheelsEvents.com, SoutheastWheelsEvents.com, and UKWheelsEvents.com. And while you're there, be sure to add and share 
your events directly to the calendars. See you at the shows.